Valentine's Day. You might remember that last year Drexel Gilbert went on the road to an elementary school to get first graders definitions of love. Those are always the best. Well, this year Drexel is finding out if the definition of love changes as we age in our marriages through the decades. What are we going to write? You when we're young, love is pretty simple. Love is like if you see somebody and your heart goes boom. When you love someone that you really love, that you like draw pictures for them and stuff. But does love change as we mature? Here's the plug. We zoomed with some experts at Niceville's Blue Water Bay Senior Living Community to find out. It's having someone by your side telling you he loves you. For 69 years, Marty Shearer's someone has been her husband, Joe, who says love is finding... Somebody that I can confide in, somebody that was part of me, made my life complete. Marty and Joe say their religious faith deepens their love. I feel it's the real important part is have a spiritual connection. Faith in each other is critical to Mac and Liz Gay, married 38 years. One of the things uh, that we both uh, need is trust. And like the little boy who said love makes your heart go boom, Judy Haugen says regardless of your age, doesn't hurt if there's a little chemistry going on. And he was in his uniform and I said to myself, not bad. And what he said to himself was at the time we wore miniskirts, nice legs. <laughs> so that's <laughs> Seems that boom factor can last a lifetime if you work at it. We go to sleep holding hands and we sit in our recliners and every once in a while he'll stick his hand out and say I love you and just little romantic things like that. At kindness, when he opens the door, <laughs> he gets my chain for me. <laughs> Trust. To have trust in the other one. And humor. What's the secret to staying married happily, as you obviously are, uh, for 69 years? Saying yes, dear. <laughs> <laughs> and you have a definition of love that's a keeper. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. Zoom in on the road in Pensacola and Niceville with photojournalist Jason Garcia. <laughs> I'm Garcia Gilbert, WKRG News 5.